Good evening. I returned from a trip to the Gulf Coast to speak with you about a battle we're waging against an oil spill that is assaulting our shores and our citizens. Because there has never been a leak this size and at this depth. Stopping it has tested the limits of human technology. Now, we've tried everything to plug the hole. Nothing has worked. And that is why I am calling upon my cousin, Demetrius Lavoris Johnson, to step in and fix the problem. He has a unique and timely plan to plug the hole. And I have seen him handle many holes. So we are fortunate. Demetrius, I turn this over to you. Let's plug that hole. Thank you, cousin. President. Hey, look at that. Can I use your office, man? That's fine with me. Cool, cool. Hey, y'all. Uh, y'all follow me. I want to thank my cousin Boogie for giving me, uh, excuse me, uh, President Barack Obama, for giving me the opportunity to help plug the hole. Everybody trying all different ways, but I think the best way to plug that hole is to put people in it. Yeah, that's right. See, I'm talking about real human people. They make the best plugs. Just stuff them in the hole and stop that all. But you got to put the right people in it. Not everybody deserves to be put in the hole. But some do. So I say the first person to stuff in the hole is the one and only Mr. George W. Bush Jr. All this mess my cousin got to deal with started with him. So I say we put him in the hole. Excuse me. And the next person that needs to go in there, a person with so much hate that he makes the devil blush. And that is the radio personality, Rush Limbaugh. I said it, Rush, and I don't care what you say about me, because guess what? We put you in the hole! And then there's Sarah Palin. <laughs> Sarah, do you think that there's a possibility that you may be able to see Russia from the hole? I don't think so. But nevertheless, we put you in the hole! The next person who needs to go in that hole is that nasty, no good ex-husband of Sandra Bullock. How you gonna blindside Sandra and her cute little black baby? Put him in the hole! And why you ready to put his nasty, tattooed girlfriend in the hole too? Now, my cousin and I are fam. We know there's some black folks that need to go in the hole too. And that list, <laughs> uh, that list can be long. But this being one year since we was robbed of the king of pop, the greatest performer of all time, put that no good doctor of Michael Jackson's, Conrad Murray, in the hole! You look at me closely. All oh, you saggers out there. All of you young folks that's running around with your pants hanging off your behind. Everybody looking at your drawers. Everybody looking at the crack of your behind. Look at me. If you don't pull your pants up. I said if you hmm, don't pull your pants up. Look at me now. We gonna put you in the house. So pull your pants up. And finally, to really plug that hole, we need the man who sits at the top of this Gulf oil disaster. No more meetings with my cousin. No more, I'm sorry, America commercial. We gonna cap that hole, oh Lord. I say we gonna cap that hole by stuffing Tony Hayward, the chairman of BPR, in that hole, oh Lord. Good God Almighty, look at me y'all. I'm gonna tell you one time, and one time only, if you not on the same path with my cousin on what we trying to do with this country, we gonna put you in the hole. Oh Lord, my, 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 my.
There might be one today. I am Demetrius Johnson, and that's my plan on plugging the house!